So please unmute yourself. We are not able to hear you. Sorry, am I now audible? Yes, sir, now you are audible. Acha, isko expand kar sakte. ठीक है. Fine. Is it visible? Students who are online. Right. So you please check. Uh, this is the typical I section uh, which you can uh, see in your IS eight zero eight. What is the maximum depth of the web? What is that value? Is it six hundred mm? Overall depth. What is uh, what is the maximum overall depth value which is given in your IS eight hundred eight eight zero eight? Yes, six hundred mm. And what is the description given for that? Whether it is IS MB, IS HB, IS WB, IS JB, cap. Yes, ISMB six hundred HP ka kitna hai? Four fifty. So, कहने का मतलब है ISMB six hundred. For this particular I uh, I section, the overall depth of this B, uh, web. It is six hundred mm. Is it not? Is it beyond that? No, it will not be. Am I right? Beyond this depth, overall depth, you will not find any uh, other section. But depending upon the actual load which is available for our design purpose, we require. That the moment of inertia value should be as maximum as possible. ठीक है? इसका ही मतलब क्या हुआ? If if I wish to have maximum uh, moment of inertia value, which value should be more? Talk in terms of radius of gyration. Whether the radius of gyration should be more or less in order to achieve maximum or more moment of inertia value. Yes, should it be more or less? Itna bata. How to identify? You know, moment of inertia is equal to a into r square. So in order to have maximum uh, this r value, sorry, maximum i value, the r value should be again maximum. ठीक है? तो देखो इसका क्या है? इसका restriction है. ये मैक्सिमम डेप्थ है अवेलेबल इसका मोमेंट ऑफ इनर्शिया भी ज्यादा है बट देर आर रिक्वायरमेंट्स मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम देर आर रिक्वायरमेंट्स डिपेंडिंग अपॉन द अमाउंट ऑफ लोड दैट मेंबर में कैरी एंड फॉर दैट पर्पस वी आर सपोज्ड टू इंक्रीज द मोमेंट ऑफ इनर्शिया एंड हाउ इट कैन बी इंक्रीज बाय इंक्रीजिंग द आर वैल्यू एंड हाउ इट कैन बी अचीव दिस आर वैल्यू कैन बी अचीव I mean, the maximum value can be achieved if we arrange or if we, you know, develop a section. That is up to us. I mean, we can do that if we are in a position to develop a section which will give me the maximum R value or moment of inertia value, whatever it may be. The load carrying capacity of that section increases, and how it can be done? There are several ways and means to do that. and such kind of sections uh, which are you know developed uh, with the help of 
building up sections they are known as built up sections okay they are known as built up sections they are also known as lattice columns lattice columns okay and the typical shapes of these lattice columns are uh, if we look in the plan they are like this so what i have done i have placed two channel sections these are channel sections and they are facing each uh, facing each other is it it now these now these sections uh, they are joined together with the help of some arrangement and that arrangement we will uh, what we are going to study right these arrangements are very typical and you must have came across such kind of arrangements in the campus itself okay try to recall i will i am i am going to explain you everything but in the duration of that explanation you will definitely come across one thing which you have noticed which you daily notice okay so fine such kind of arrangement where two or more members are getting attached with each other in order to increase or enhance the load carrying capacity as far as the action load is concerned that is known as built up built up sections or built up columns they are also known as lattice now this is the plan and i mean the top view the view which are which we are uh, looking from the top of any member that's what i have drawn if i am talking in terms of the dimensional view it will be something of this sort okay so these are let's say two channel sections Okay. Are you able to visualize this? Yes. You have observed that three-dimensional view. Process. Now see, you you must have observed such type of arrangement. <laughs> have you observed such type of arrangement wherein? these two channel sections they are held together okay sometimes you must have also observed this horizontal plates okay so you can see these diagonal or inclined plates they are known as lacing and these horizontal plates they are known as patterns these lacing and patterns they comprise of the complete built up section i mean they are the uh, inherent members of this built up section okay and the property of these uh, lacings and patterns is well defined by your is code what is the importance of this lacing and patterning it says the necessity of the lacing or patterning is just to hold the two members or two or more members in position it will not contribute in load distribution uska purpose kya hai just to hold the complete members in position that's it no other thing 
ठीक है दिस इज द पर्पज ऑफ दिस लेसिंग एंड बैटिंग ओके नाउ रिकॉल ये सिस्टम आपने कहा देखा डेली आप देखते हो I'm not drawing the three-dimensional view, only two-dimensional view. ये कहाँ पे देखा आपने बोले? देखा ये कहाँ पे देखी आपने? मंदिर के अपोजिट शेड और अगर मंदिर के पास नहीं गए होंगे आप लोग एक जगह आप देखी जाते हो कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ लेसनिंग एंड बैटनिंग This should not be done. The reason behind this is, if we provide such kind of arrangement, we just look closely. ये जो arrangement है, it looks similar to the truss system, isn't it? Truss का क्या purpose होता है? To carry axial force and to transfer the force. But the very purpose of the uh, provision of lacing, lacing and binding is to avoid such kind of force transmission. It is just to hold two or more members in position. That is the purpose. Okay. So although in your IS code you will find the figures which represent the combination of lacing and binding, you are supposed to avoid them. Either you go for lacing or you go for binding. Even you know battings are, I mean the batter batters are they are not uh, recommended. Lacing is what is most recommended design. Are you getting me? So to some extent, I hope you have understood this figure, the purpose of lacing and battening. Okay, and why we are providing the build-up section? I I suppose you have understood it because in the initial. Uh, The explanation itself, I have told you, in order to carry heavy loads and to go beyond the sections which are available in the market or those which are given in your IS 808, we are supposed to make such kind of arrangements. Okay, is this okay? Right. So we are going to discuss about the design of this, but before that, uh, see, in addition to uh, such kind of arrangement. In your IS eight hundred two thousand seven, you will also find such arrangements. You see, cross arrangements like this. This is known as double lacing system. These are single lacing system. Okay. These are known as double lacing. These are also there. You may also go for the design of double lacing system, and these are also recommended. Okay, but combination of lacing and batten, these are to be avoided. The reason I have told you, it will defy the purpose of lacing and batten. The purpose is very simple, very clear, just to hold. The members in position, and it will allow it will allow these members to deform accordingly. And now, so column's uh, main purpose is what? Main uh, failure is what? Bubbling, right? So for that load, this particular member should be allowed to bubble in one direction. Understood? In this direction, because you can see over here there is no protection as such. So the buckling will take place like this. So no problem. Let it get buckled. We should know. We should know uh, about which axis this is going to get failed. Right? Is this okay? Is this clear? So you please open.
can you please uh, uh, open me page number 48 of is 808 uh, sorry is 800 page 48 of is 800 2007 क्या दिया है उसमें तो यू प्लीज कीप योर पेज नंबर फोर्टी एट ओपन and what we will do is we will be discussing the design of such kind of built up sections <laughs> some necessary additional information is given from that page 48 onwards we will be discussing it step by step right so i hope you have understood the purpose of this built up sections why it has to be provided what is the necessity isn't it i hope you have understood this so we will take up this numerical straightforward uh, information is given to us try to think that what situation under what circumstances such kind of built up sections may be available with us just try to visualize right so fine we will be discussing this the students who are uh, online are you able to see the screen yes sir yes sir So, I will have to move like this. Okay. The problem it says that design a built up column which is 10 meter long. Just think, 10 meter long, a vertical member you have to design. Now, you have to consider the lens. Consider ki hai. How, what was it? 3 meter, 4 meter. Now over here it is 10 meter long. Try to imagine the condition and the load that column will carry. This is going to, if you provide that ISMB 600, which is the last member or the member which has got highest capacity. If you provide that, you will find it is not suitable. It will fail. And we will have to make certain arrangements based on which that member will carry the maximum load or whatever the load is given to us. Okay. So 10 meter long. To carry a factored actual load of 1080 kilonewton. The column is restrained in position but not in direction. Restrained in position, but not in direction. Fix what? Ye fix bol raha What do I say? Restrained in position ka matlab kya hua? It is not allowed to move. But not in direction it is not restrained in direction that is it can rotate these two ends move uh, you know, but moment create that means it is a hinge condition or at both ends so the both the ends for this numerical is hinge or are hinge now see, provide single lacing system. Here, uh, particularly, you have mentioned that you are supposed to provide single lacing system with bolted connections. This is what is given. Assume FE410 grade 4.6. Uh, sorry, and grade 4.6. Two cases are given. First case. Design the column with two channels placed back to back. And second case is when they are placed toe to toe. This situation, which I have drawn here. 
बट इट अभी देखो नॉट नेसेसरीली ऑल द टाइम यू विल गेट चैनल सेक्शन समटाइम्स आय सेक्शन कैन ऑल्सो बी बिल्ट अप और एंगल सेक्शन फोर एंगल सेक्शन कैन इवन बी ज्वाइन टूगेदर लेट अस सी हाउ ये ऑनलाइन वालों को दिख रहा है क्या बोर्ड का नहीं सर यस सर बोर्ड का दिख रहा है बोर्ड यस सर ओके फाइन there are four angles okay and now this four are four angles are supposed to be joined together with the help of let's say lacing ye top view hai lacing systems necessarily are to be provided on both the sides of uh, this system okay ye ek ye got it ठीक है so now one thing in such kind of built up uh, sections uh, the izz is equal to iyy or in this case the uh, minor axis is the yy axis initially because you can see ye individual yy axis okay in case of let's talk about channel section channel section mein bada easy hai aapko understand because you will find this horizontal axis which is the major axis of the signal channel section and this is the minor axis of signal and channel section over here you will notice that this is the common axis for the channel section horizontal axis major axis whereas the minor axis there are two we are supposed to arrange the minor axis moment of inertia in such a way that it should be greater than or equal to the major axis or in other words ry which is the radius of gyration of the minor axis this should be greater than or equal to ry this is the situation or this is the condition for which we are supposed to design isse kya hoga जो मेजर एक्सेस के आगे अबाउट जो आपका मोमेंट ऑफ इनर्शिया वैल्यू है वही आपका माइनर एक्सेस के अबाउट ही भी रहेगा सो देर इज अथ विथ सिचुएशन एंड बिकॉज ऑफ विच लोड कैरिंग कैपेसिटी विल बी एनहांस इन अबाउट बोथ अबाउट बोथ एक्सेस इसलिए ये जो मैंने फिगर्स में निकाले हैं वी आर नोटिस दे आर वेरी सिमेट्रिकल अबाउट बोथ एक्सेस सो दैट कंडीशन हैज टू बी देर राइट we will be discussing all these things but you may come across such kind of problem wherein four angle sections are to be connected okay this is also one of the case next case which we will be discussing that is the second case uh, rather the first case because we we have discussed about the two to the condition back to back ka matlab kya hua this this channel section in case of a bit the name this lay they are facing back to back okay but we are supposed to provide 
पहले स्टेटमेंट मैंने लिखा है क्या लिखा है मेंशन दी आईएस कोड पहली लाइन में आप डिफाइन कर दो कि आई एम गोइंग टू मेक यूज ऑफ आईएस 800 2007 आईएस 808 फॉर दी फॉलोइंग डिजाइन ठीक है वो एक बार क्लियर कर दिया उसके बाद आप सिर्फ और सिर्फ क्लॉज नंबर मेंशन करो दैट्स इट then i will not expect any kind of is 800 2007 or something of that sort just mention the re, uh, relevant clauses theek hai and remember why i am telling you listen ye har bar main repeat kyu kar raha hu because you people after getting graduated you people will go to some design forms in those design forms Although the Excel sheets and all are uh, available with you people, will be available with you. But for any design and for any Excel sheet, you will find the references are always mentioned. They will be there, and you are supposed to follow. You are supposed to make a practice from this stage itself. ठीक है? Try to inculcate all these good habits. so that afterwards it won't be you know <coughs> a very uh, new thing for you people nahi to kya hota hai are ye to humne kabhi kiya hai aisa bhi ho sakta hai jab aap log design office mein jaoge aur koi design karoge so you will come across such kind of situations theek hai right then the important things gamma m not and gamma m b these are partial safety factors for material and for bolt okay factor load is already given so you need not to multiply the uh, value of load by 1.5 since the column is restrained in position that is no movement and it is not restricted in the direction that is there are some uh, rotations So it is hinge. Find out the k value from table eleven. So you please refer table eleven. I may be wrong. K value may galat bhi ho sakta. Please refer. IS code up. Look, follow. Table number eleven. Which one page number is? Huh? One four. Is it forty eight? Oh, forty eight. Bolta. What is the page number? Table number eleven. No, no, table eleven. So from the table eleven, what value of k will you get for this condition? One. So one ये बराबर लिखा है. इस साइड से आप लोगों को शायद दिखता नहीं है. बोल. ये वाला प्रोजेक्टर का. नहीं दिख रहा. Okay. Uh, then you calculate the effective length. ठीक है? Effective length calculation is to be carried out. Effective length will be k times l. So over here k value uh, it came out to be one, and therefore the effective length will be whatever is the value of l, ten thousand and then. ठीक है, शेल वी प्रोसीड यस ऑल ऑफ यू यस द नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज टू डिसाइड द सेक्शन सी इन द न्यूमेरिकल इट इज मेंशन दैट यू आर सपोज टू डिजाइन चैनल सेक्शन 
तो अभी क्या करना है चैनल सेक्शन इज नोन ये इंफॉर्मेशन तो मिली है नाउ यू आर सपोज टू डिसाइड द डायमेंशन व्हाट शुड बी परफेक्ट डायमेंशन बेस्ड ऑन विच द लोड विल बी कैरिड ओके सो देर आर फ्यू एजम्पन विच यू आर सपोज टू डू वी हैव टू अज्यूम the design compressive stress for the column dekho there are two thing two ways either you can uh, select lambda value that is the slenderness ratio or you can directly go for the the decision of fcd value that is up to you range i have given for such kind of situation mind it uh, for such situation where the uh, length of the member is very large compared to the other dimensions or uh, what we call it as the columns for such cases your fcd value should be between 120 to 150 mpa or the lambda value comes near about 90 i i think so that we will verify okay but fcd should be 120 to 150 mpa once you uh, decide upon the uh, compressive stress design fcd value you can calculate the area which is required area required shall be p divided by fcd value okay this comes out to be 7200 mm aap check kar lo you can verify this value ठीक है चल भी मूव है देन सिंस देर आर टू चैनल सेक्शन विच आर विच इज गिवन इन यूर न्यूमरिकल सिलेक्ट लेट से आई एस एम सी थ्री हंड्रेड सो फॉर सिंगल आई एस एम सी थ्री हंड्रेड दी एरिया विच इज गिवन इन यूर आई एस एट जीरो एट फोर सिक्स थ्री जीरो एम एम स्क्वेर आप चेक करो फोर सिक्स थ्री जीरो एम एम स्क्वेर हो सकता है सेंटीमीटर स्क्वेयर में दिया हो उसको एम एम स्क्वेयर में मैंने कन्वर्ट किया सी यू कैन मेक यूज ऑफ दिस थिंग ऑल्सो स्टील टेबल दैल्यूज आर बिट डिफरेंट बट डोंट वरी डोंट वरी मच तो ये बराबर है क्या सिंगल आई एस एफ सी थ्री हंड्रेड उसका एरिया जो है आई हैव रिटर्न इट एज Four six three zero mm square. You please verify. Okay. Then the other parameters are uh, radius of gyration about z and y axis. So z axis ke against it is one one eight mm. One one eight point zero liter. One one eight mm. You please verify. ठीक है सिमिलरली यू प्लीज वेरीफाई दी आर वाई वैल्यू ये देखो आर जेड इज नथिंग बट आर एक्स वैल्यू जो जेड जेड एक्सिस है वो इट इज नथिंग बट योर ऑरिजोटल एक्स एक्स एक्सिस सो दिस दिस वैल्यू दिस इज एक्चुअली आर एक्स विच इज गिवन इन योर आई एस एट जीरो एट सो फाइन आर वाई इज ट्वेंटी सिक्स एम एम now you can see the rz value is 118 which is quite more than the ry few more information we will be required that is cy value this is the breadth of the flange p suffix f this will be required you can note down iz and iy these two values are again required so you are supposed to note down all these values which will be required for our further design purpose is this visible aapko dikh raha hai uh verify karo or please let me know whether these values are okay dikh raha hai aap logo ko 
Uh, 23.5 mm that must be in centimeter it is in mm 2.35 centimeter over centimeter over thoda zoom karke dekho i think it is 23.5 mm I said zero eight, man. It should not be. Both come in. It should not be the case, actually. Am I? And what about uh, this thing? Hmm. Acha, can you please open IS eight hundred two thousand seven? And in the annex chair, you will find uh, there are again channel sections which are given. In that, you please verify what is the R Y or C Y value for this. If it is mentioned, ठीक है फॉर टाइम बिंग यू जस्ट नोट डाउन वॉट एवर इज द वैल्यू ऑफ सी वाई विच इज गिवन इन यूर आई एस एट जीरो एट वी विल सी दीकेशन ऑफ सी वाई एट दैट टाइम अवर आइडियाज विल गेट क्लियर हो सकता है मैंने कुछ रॉन्ग लिखा है ओके राइट देन यस एस एरिया विच इज प्रोवाइडेड फॉर डबल आई एस एम सी थ्री हंड्रेड that will be twice of the value whatever we have assumed now see uh, listen carefully all of you ye jo section maine assume kiya hai uh, i have taken the area on the very higher side if you can notice otherwise i have told you that 5 to 10% more can be can even be uh, chosen it is up to the designer you can select as per your wish and will but while selecting make sure that this area should be more than area required that care you are supposed to take uh, no two design can be similar ye jo hai ye trial error se maine isse pehle aur ek section consider kiya tha whose area was just more than the area of whatever area is required but it fit because of which i have discussed this particular case okay so the next class we will see and we i will get clarified about the ci by value isliye maine aap logo ko thoda aaya set 08 thoda sa dekhna hoga theek hai so uh, i hope you people must have joined the online lecture as well 
but still join with us. Join this online. Connect कर दो। The reason I am telling you because the attendance will be marked.